then Sophie Kaiba as well. And Pinstripe. Oh boy, time for Sam, you're right. So one thing I'll tell you up front, I'm not going to swap the screens as much as I did for the uh, DS streams. And this is the reason why. The DS streams, or the DS screens are the same size for both of them. These ones aren't. The top screen is considerably wider. I was playing wider. Investigations 2 and R6 at the same time to catch up and keep ahead of you. And now you're doing the game I was saving for last. I've never been owned so hard before <laughs> in my life. Hey, gotta put a mix up once in a while and once every couple months seems fine. But yeah, so the screens aren't the same width, so if I need to highlight something on the lower screen, I, I will. But it looks like this. So just as a heads up, that's why that's cut off like that. If I do highlight the lower screen, it's not a by choice thing. It's Nintendo insists on not using reasonable resolutions for things. Um, also, it might get a little chuggy during the FMVs because this is a relatively new emulator. This is a 3DS, so it's not going to be perfect. But all that being said, let's do it. Fuck. Yo, thanks for the follow. Also, I gotta be real. Kinda into 85% <laughs> this music. Thank you for the resub. <laughs> But in the olden times, <laughs> for what it's worth, it is mostly old. From what I've checked, which has not been a lot, it's only been the FMVs, but it seems like the gameplay portions run fine. So, now, Oh, and as a heads up, uh, I've been informed that in this game, they may... Uh, no, thank you for the bits. <laughs> At last, they change Chechenia of their sleeve. So, as a heads up, they for they made the choice, and it's a choice people make one way or the other, uh, to leave in some ye old uh, slurs. And they did it for periodic accuracy and stuff. And while I don't agree with that choice, it is here. Um, and as a heads up, uh, that is not licensed to say those words in chat. Just going to put it on the table now so that people don't try and make that excuse later. You will absolutely get banned. I don't care if it's on screen. You know better. All right. So moving along. This is the only Ace Attorney game one know literally nothing about, so this yeah. will be an adventure. That's, what, that, that's one reason I wanted to do this one, is I've been getting to experience all of these blind. But I thought it'd be fun if we could have one blind together. And I know it's only a few very diehard fans who have really gone out and played this one already when the, fra when the fan translation, like immediately became available because so I think it was like a couple months ago I think it might have been when I was playing Ace Attorney 2 or 3 when it released Ooh. 
Ooh, boy, this part is running very slow now that I'm streaming. Oh, hmm. You know, I tested this, <clears throat> and it was 100 per- <clears throat> Sorry. 100% when not being streamed. Hmm. Let me see if there's anything I can turn off to get this to slow it up a little bit. If not, we may have to put this off until, uh, until, uh, uh Tuesday and do something else for now. Just finished this one I've myself. Been told the Looking blue forward to seeing everyone's thoughts on the game. Runs okay. Let me see if that helps. Okay. Okay. I think I got it. There were a few hardware shaders that weren't default enabled for some reason and were still on software shading, which is considerably less efficient, so. Whew, wipe that sweat bullet off. We're good. Yeah, no, it was dipping to like 64% speed. It sounded bad because it was bad. <laughs> I am glad this guy has a lovingly animated headband at all times. Asugi. I honestly like this style a lot, like the kind of 3D models. It feels like if they took the kind of like Ace Attorney art style and the ghost trick animating methods they learned with like 3D stuff and like really went in to make a couple that were, you know, super detailed. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but it looks like a combination of the two techniques in a way that I really like. It looks really good. Sorry if sometimes when I try and talk about art, I sound like a babbling idiot. It's because I have no education in that field. <laughs> so I'm kind of just winging it on a lot of it. <laughs> So this is at the beginning of the judicial system. Congrats, you passed the bar. Oh, or are studying abroad. Okay, so studying foreign legal systems. An honorable pursuit. <laughs> it is a very good review from Streets Bandana. A few of my favorite things are law, water Man with a nice. from Streets Bandana Flutter though. And dirt. Like there is something that is driving me crazy that was not super obvious until I have started streaming, and now it is driving me right up a wall. And sorry, there was a pixel or two of the bottom screen on the other side, 
and it was making my heart hurt looking at it. Okay, there we go. There is no longer a weird sliver of yellow. I apologize for my sloppy handicraft. Please tell me the judge looks basically the same. Sure, I'm just standing here. I am both glad that our character's name is Ryu, and also a little disappointed that the guy with the headband's name is not Ryu. But I understand that that is, you know, not the intention. Okay, yeah, gonna get some foreign law. Oh, hmm. They do all sorts of shitty things in their selection committee. Sounds like a selection committee. <laughs> Is it the first time we're trying a new legal system? Is it the legal system of guilty until proven not only guilty until proven innocent, guilty until proven innocent and also you proved someone else guilty, which is the Phoenix right way. <laughs> Okay. I need to say I am, apparently. Huh. So we need to be... But what if I was the attorney? Ooh, I do like this cinematic slow zoom. The flash to black and white in a slow zoom is a nice touch.
November 22nd. Woo! Supreme Court 2. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, wow. The nice thing about the newer technology is they can really render how uncomfortable our character looks in this situation. Which is pretty much everything. Damn, that's good. <laughs> Man, I have I have felt this way before. The eye jiggle too, the rapid eye movements, like trying to scan across the room and figure shit out is very good. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> the pain got me. Okay, this is a pretty good judge. This pain is very strong, and I'm glad for pain in particular. They just made him just pain <laughs> in diff outfit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is very powerful stress imagery. This is big stress imagery right here. This is someone absolutely going in entirely for their friend and feeling really not okay with it, but doing it. <laughs> <laughs> God, you even got the pain animation real good. So glad so far our dude has not chilled even a little bit. Like we are still just nerves shaking. <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Oh my god, these animations are so choice. These animations are so choice. Y'all. If you ask me, could you successfully fully animate Ace Attorney and 100% keep the spirit of it, like absolutely correctly, I would probably say no. Oh, can I just save whenever? I probably should have tested being able to save in retrospect. That is one thing I never checked. Does this just have save states? Does not seem like it. Well, here's to hoping. <laughs> if not, I'll, uh, I'll figure something out. Oh no, I, uh, like... <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Joke's on you, idiot. I'm the one who doesn't believe in me. court record here. Hey! <laughs> I was like, is that going to add a court record button? Yes. Let's review the evidence real shortly here. Okay, died after 2 p.m. Shot in the chest, blood, death, bullet did not pass through body. Uh, the one as a student. Okay. Okay, so that's what we need is the victim, Watson. Oh my god, it is actually just Watson. So I had heard one of the reasons that these games have had some trouble being localized. And there, you know, it's always a complicated problem, right? Like, it's never just one thing. That's a pretty common misconception. It's almost always a culmination of ten different factors. But one of them is having Watson, and I believe Sherlock Holmes may in fact be involved later on. Uh, maybe, but it's the, the Doyle estate is notoriously litigious, from my understanding. So, like, you can't bring Watson out of Japan because you will be in huge trouble. And thank you for the bids, Yggdrasil. I'm glad Pain just immediately goes to the trying to shame you and make you look bad thing. His favorite move. Okay.
what's kind of interesting, and it might just be that it's been so long since I've played Ace Attorney 1 that I don't remember it, this feels like they're doing a lot more of the character building and character introduction for Naruhoto and, um, the, uh, I'm already forgetting his name, the dude who is supposed to be our defense attorney. They're putting a lot of character building into them up front. Okay, so that's just the post-mortem documents. <clears throat> Asugi. Okay. Point blank didn't exit. This is looking through papers. This is what I look like when I'm looking through papers. Like, especially when I was in an engineering office, me just going around my desk being like, no, not this pit. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> wait, I have 12 different stacks of papers. I think that was in number seven. Give me a sec. They won't, they won't give me a bigger cube or any additional cabinets. I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, we have a photograph of where the gunshot was. Yeah, so it was between the shoulder and the upper right pectoral. Okay, that's a really fun detail of just, what the fuck? Oh, I've never actually seen a picture before. Whoa, is this one of those daguerreotypes? <laughs> what is a daguerreotype? That was a very good hand motion. Yo, I'm Kid Trigon, thank you for the resub. <laughs> Photography must exist. According to Article <laughs> 6, Section 9 of the Ace Attorney Accord, photographs must exist. Look, it becomes really hard to build a game around solving mysteries if you both make the assumption of witnesses are horribly inaccurate and imprecise and you need to weasel information out of them to get the accurate stuff and like clarify and then also pictures don't exist that would be so hard to have both of those be true at the same time because photographs at least give you some solid this has happened assuming you know we're still assuming there's no photoshop which hey at least now there definitely won't be photoshop How much fun do you think they had animating that headband? The Toru? Okay. I have been playing and watching too much Samurai Showdown because as soon as I saw <laughs> the cop, my brain just, oh god, he's gonna sub a guy, she, time to block high. Ugh. Ukyo. 
The question is, what do you think disease is it? Do you think it's tuberculosis? This has been really good. I, I, I've got very Ace Attorney meets Dark Cloud 2 vibes, and that is... That's a plus, my friends. That's a big plus. <laughs> Hi. Also, I'm very glad we have taken... Everyone messing up <laughs> like or uh, like all the people on their first day being terribly terribly unprepared and thrown against the wall and just kind of being like here you go have fun kid <laughs> have fun doing law and they've taken it to the logical conclusion which is <laughs> this guy wasn't even a lawyer <laughs> this, this is just a lawyer's friend this is a lawyer's friend doug <laughs> doug you're in <laughs> Get in there, Doug. You got this. This track right here, this music track, is really doing it for me. Just on the record. But I really want to yell objection, is the thing. I really want to yell objection always. So we're gonna have to blow him up for that. I see we're finally meeting the concept of blowing up a fool for lying. Hey, does anyone have any clocks in here? Just wanted to check, anyone? Got any nearby clocks? Uh huh. Okay, good. 
Yeah, here we go. I didn't mean for this evidence to get used as evidence. Because he has <laughs> fucked up on that document somehow. Just chill on this. <laughs> Enhance. <laughs> I live for decisive witnesses. No, please. This is my favorite thing. Is that the first fist slam of history, actually? That might be it. That might be the first court fist slam in history. And that might be the first point in history. The first one. He just made it up, just now. How do you like it? I think technically that is the original PowerPoint for what it's worth. I think that was PowerPoint, but before PowerPoint and not PowerPoint, but a PowerPoint, not a PowerPoint, to be clear. Humble peddler of time. Do you make clocks? Do you have a lot of clocks? Also, damn, dual witnesses? Is that legal?
Okay. Yeah, did I hear a baby or was that just me who thought I heard a weird baby? I thought maybe I was just very tired, but I swore I heard a weird baby. Shot from behind. No, it's not. Okay, good. So our first present is going to be gunshot was to the front, uh, which I believe that's what the photograph was added of, right? In retrospect, don't just pick up a gun from wherever. <laughs> don't just pick one up. I'm raising my hand because it's my turn. <laughs> I'm raising my hand like a kid in kindergarten because I don't know what to do and I'm more or less, more or less just kind of winging it, just kind of doing what comes naturally. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
Yo, thank you for the resub. <laughs> yeah, he looks like he's having a very bad time. <laughs> God, like, they're so good at making him uncomfortable, Lamel. Okay. Like, with Apollo, it was, like, a nervous excitement, right? Because, like, he studied for it. He was ready for it. He came here. This is, I don't know what I'm doing here, and I don't understand what's going on around me. I'm just doing my best. <laughs> I'm not a lawyer. Also, this reaction of just, like, yo, that PowerPoint, though. I gotta, I gotta steal that. <laughs> that move's good. best part is I think they they set it up to make the no you are the defense drop like as late as possible because it's literally after they're already in court <laughs> and then he's like oh I heard someone else was gonna be the defense boy <laughs> weak little slap was so goddamn funny holy shit oh i'm glad i played four other games first because that little slap oh man <laughs> this is like everyone else him <laughs> they're just like a little like little <laughs> little slap <laughs> oh his lack of confidence is audible it's so good Uh-huh. Hi! What is the weird baby noise? <laughs> Alright, just push evidence. Got it. <laughs> Slap. Baby sounds. <laughs> Slap baby sounds. Slap baby sounds was one of the lines MC Hammer was testing out before he decided to go with stop hammer time. Because in the end, stop hammer time worked a lot better than slap baby sounds, which would be pretty good. All right, let's get a photograph of this victim. And yeah. Ah, I can't present from the detail screen, but I can look very close. Mm, it would appear the victim has been shot <laughs> and also didn't touch his steak. Is there a wooden cutting board under his plate? What? <laughs> oh, I don't think he even got to pour wine. It's the saddest story of all time.
God, the way he looks at his own hand afterwards to like make sure he didn't slap anything important. <laughs> <laughs> uh, whoever is on this animating team just has animating anxiety down to his art. Hold your horses. Hey, hold them horses. I'm not sure if this is the objection theme, but it has some objection energy. At the very least. Again, the music for this, they've managed to make it very distinctive. And not just purely by instrument choice either. Like, they've made compositional choices as well. They didn't just hot swap out all the instruments for ye old Japanese instruments. It's a really good comp uh, like composition. Is it just me or is Asugi like Phoenix Wright and Miles Edgeworth but at the same time? Maybe a little bit. Sorry, I just got distracted by a baby. <laughs> I think with the reason. Ooh, that pivot was nice. <laughs> Legal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain. So we need to prove who actually did gunshot. Okay. Fancy boy coin. Oh, 
Also, I will say the 3D model is letting them make this old man vibrate in a very old way. Okay, so we have a thievery on top of it. Thank you for the bits. Also, for the fact, that's true, La Quantos is Spanish for the Quantos. <laughs> hmm, I wonder if there's a baby steal the baby stole it. Baby shot him? Baby gun. Okay, more testimony, that's fine. Damn, that's a pretty big combo play right there. Having a cool baby that clearly just is enjoying being here is pretty strong. Okay. Sure. Was there anyone else here? Why? If there was a lady dining with him, why are we the only ones who are aware? So half the steak was eaten here, and the wine glass was half full. Okay, yeah, the glass could be full there. It's a little hard to tell. But... It looks like there's almost more steak. Okay, there's three complete lines on the left. Three complete lines 
another complete line and then a bite on the very edge of it. Compare that to full line, full line, full line, full line. Yeah, someone took a bite out of this steak after... Is this guard fucking hiding it because he wanted to eat their steaks? Now there's the real Phoenix Wright energy. That's the real Phoenix Wright energy. Anyone can be cocky and, you know, point and do all that and bluff and all that, but realizing you're so boned and putting it, this is the real big, this is the definitive Phoenix Wright energy right here, I think. That's the thing we're trying to push, yeah. Let's... Just getting to this now, huh? Good to see the prosecutors have been doing the same thing for many years. Noon to one. I mean, it's another clock to establish. Absolutely. Yeah, give me as many clocks as possible, please. Says a moron. 
<laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. Medical report. Oh, I can't. Okay. Hmm. Uh, I think I am right. Unless they're teaching me how to look at things up close, which may be the case. Okay, yeah, it seems that way. Okay. Same stuff. Gotta make sure I know how to use the dial, so it's probably something... Oh, right. Uh, let's check the info here, and then we'll check that peeled portion. Also, sorry, I should be... Should have swapped that. My bad. <laughs> Look, he just had it before Ryu, I think. How did this dude steal Ryu's bandana? Yo, thank you for the sub, Mr. T8 in my balls. The thank baby. You for the resub, I appreciate it. Alright, let's flip this dock open. to exact can I just click once for all of it I'm guessing
Oh, so there being one meal makes sense now. Forbidden to consume anything other than water. Just wing it, dude. That's what most people do for law. Yo, Vega Baby, thank you for the resub. What up, what up? How's it going? I appreciate it. Enjoy your terrible raisin hands. Which is a emote now, by the way. <laughs> the big hands and you didn't check either you just put them fucking down <laughs> yeah there it is Also, I need to check the other stuff now that I have Investigate. There might be stuff on the back of that business card that was handed to us. Alright, that one was like 50-50. Like, that one lacked the confidence, but it wasn't all the way lacking in confidence. He didn't check his hand, and it wasn't a slap. There we go, there's the first big one. Also, I think it's easier to be confident if you have a friend in a cool bandana with a katana next to you. I think my confidence would easily be twice as high if my best friend was chilling next to me with a katana and a cool bandana 
being like, you got it, man. I'd be like, yeah, I do got it. You're right. <laughs> and for the record, it totally makes sense for them to have a sword because there are so many times you would have to... Like, there was a period, I think, where you were, like, legally mandated to wear a sword if you were part of a certain class. My Japanese history, though, isn't super strong or anything, so that might be incorrect. But I thought I remember that being a real thing. be someone else. <laughs> Damn, this kid's relatable. All over.
What? <laughs> Oh man, there's no way to flip it over all the way. That's painful. I guess this whole side is examinable. Wait, why is it a police? Oh, that's an interesting business card to have. I still need to investigate. Check this. The big thing being there are already bites out of the stake. Fork is on the left. That's pretty standard. Burn some folks. Yeah, nothing weird in this one. I don't think there's anything weird in this one. Yeah, there's, you can't flip it around or anything. Okay. And so we're good. Man, I decided to check that shit out at a really primo time, huh? Waiter cop with consumption. Hi!
All right, now we present the card. Now that we've investigated it. Hi. <laughs> you need to look at the. You need to turn it flip ways. Flipways? What do you mean by flipways? Just uh, the back. Just use the back. Keep that quiet. That's the other big question here, right? Like, <laughs> step one, they did it. Step two, but why? Yo, thank you for the resub. Super dollar coin. What up? Or yes, attorney, origins. Yeah, I was gonna say, probably undercover if there's all these important people to happening. Okay, well, at least we've blown up the move.
I mean, do you think British people don't murder other British people? I did actually good detective stuff after I rolled over to a corrupt system. Okay. Now we know he's not, so... Thus begins... The real part. The question is... I mean, we're certainly gonna pull... Her up, right? To testify? A detective with his livelihood at risk, who's occasionally a bit of a dink, but, you know, is doing his best to really detective it up. <coughs> I do like that they're establishing really early that the government fear is very strong right now, and also the relations between Japan and Britain are very new still, and very fresh, and everyone is very nervous about it. Just because, I mean, Japan uh, was closed off for a very long time, comparatively, you know, to the rest of the world. I would like to save. Thank you. Peace. Let's, uh, go ahead and at least do a Second, second part here. for being a big nervous fuck up you did all right kid <laughs> <laughs>
I was pretty shook from realizing I was just implicated in a murder. It's the good professor. Hello. Fuck. And yo, thank you for the follow. Oh man, is there only 17 left? Oh man. Yo, if we get 17 new follows, we're gonna be doing some very good Wii trash. And I think I'm actually free this weekend, so if we got it before Saturday, I think I'd be able to do it Saturday. Let me check before I run my mouth. But yeah, hey, if you aren't already following, you should. First of all, so that you can alleviate your fear of missing out, which is one of the nastier Fuck. parts of the human psyche. Yo, thank you. And welcome to the freedom of the fear of missing out, because now you'll get an email. And also, yeah, we do a lot of trash. If you have some friends who watch streams and whatnot, Fuck. maybe open their eyes to the concept of, you know, there's people who just play a lot of different games and are just, you know, I'd say medium charming, <laughs> as opposed to people who are just very good at one competitive game. Check it out. I appreciate it. Thank y'all for the follows. 15 away now. Oof. Thank you as well. <laughs> Thank you, Arcane Guild. some professors, they might have been. I will say, that's, that's fair. Professors often are just pals. Yeah, so the political angle is still pretty heavy. Hmm. Yeah, you have to wonder if this is just a political thing. Or if it's more. advantages of always having a sword is if you do a sword joke you can hold it up really quickly you can be like we're gonna cut to the chase and then hold your sword up and then everyone's like ha ha because he has a sword get it <laughs> he said cut because it's a good sword <laughs>
It's like when Wolverine, like, goes into the... I can't remember what the name of the bad X-Men are, but the bad X-Men... <laughs> Wolverine goes into their base, and then an alarm starts going off, and he breaks the alarm, and he says, There's no claws for alarm! You know, like that, but with a sword, always. Also, this game's... This music is still so good. I'm really enjoying the music in this game overall. This one seems to be a pretty standout track. Honestly, now I'm really glad that I skipped ahead, because I have a playlist of, like, Ace Attorney music that I often throw on when I'm playing fighting games or doing lab work in fighting games or whatever. But I'm not allowed to put songs on it from games I haven't played yet, so now I get to add this one in once I beat this game. Huh. Dang. <laughs> I mean, that's a really good point. Like, why do you want... <laughs> why do you want to ally with the screaming toddler? That's not the right play. <laughs> For force them to not be screaming toddlers. Treat them like equals, not superiors, dum-dum. And then there, there's our good boy Ryu, just kind of standing there, just like, uh, I don't, this is all extremely over my head. I don't really do any of this. <laughs> Even though I don't know anything, I know my friend is right. I can feel it. <laughs> Also, dang, this is already pretty long for a first case. Not that that's inherently a good or a bad thing. It's just interesting to see the divergent, like, like how divergent it is from the other ones. Because the other ones, they're very fast, right? Like, the first case of one and two are both, like, like an hour, hour and a half, something like that. Like, they're quick. Don't know, don't fucking care. We're in court. I will say, that hat is busted. That hat is so strong.
See, for me, whenever I think of someone betting that they'll eat their own hat, I always assume they're going to wear like a Carmen Miranda big fruit hat for a whole day and then eat it. But no one ever thinks of, what if I just put a whole duck on my head as part of my hat, and then I just get a great duck dinner later on? Sure, I have to eat a couple flowers, but, you know, life finds a way. And yes, before anyone mentions it, I am aware that's not a duck. <laughs> I know what I... I hunted for like four years. I, I know that's not a duck. <laughs> I just realized someone might think I was confused. No, I just don't think many people eat swan. Do people eat swans, actually? Also, I do like that this is how they represent English. That's kind of fun. Fuck. If people don't... First of all, thank you for the follow. If people don't already eat swans, I guess my question is why not? Because swans are mean as shit. It is also a rare treat to see English being treated as the impossible to understand language <laughs> in media. That might sound weird, but as an American who, you know, is mostly consuming media that has been localized for, you know, America or for English speaking areas, very rarely do, does it keep, you know, like it, it consistently, like they'll, normally they would like switch this around, right? Like they would just be like, ah, this is an English court in, England, <laughs> you know? I can't believe this lady speaks in the exact language that I use to sign uh, those digital screens where after I use my like my debit card or whatever, they're like, you need to sign here. And it's always impossible because it's like signing a almost glass surface with like a hard stick and it never reads right. Like legitimately, this box she has could be six signatures that I've used in my life and I would not be able to tell you. I would absolutely believe that's what it is. Like, th this is absolutely me trying to write my name very quickly and it just turns into a line with some bumps and I say, fuck it. <laughs> Close enough. What's fun is I had a friend in high school who was just drawing the Superman symbol every single time instead of signing his name and he did that for like it was like a year and a half, two years, and then eventually his bank called him and was like, Are you doing this? Cut that shit out. <laughs> like, and it took years. <laughs> Ooh, okay. That is some pressure.
Okay. Okay. But wasn't it on his side of the table? That bugs me. Because why was it on his side of the table if you ordered it? That's something that's been bugging me for a minute. Okay, so this is all the testimony we have to work with here. Mm. What do you mean? There's a hundred places she could conceal a pistol. <laughs> like <laughs> I think the swan did it. The swan on her head no scoped a guy. <laughs> I was going to say like that's not true at all. <laughs> People are so good at hiding stuff. <laughs> Take it from me, a guy who's had to hide stuff to sneak it into a football stadium. They would let us bring in water bottles, but they wouldn't let us bring in our own alcohol, and the alcohol was way too expensive, and we were college students. What I'm saying is, you can just sneak alcohol in wherever. And I mean... There are alcohol bottles that are like the same shape as a gun. That I do know. So, I think probably just do. Yeah, it works. Pfft, easy. Okay. Why is it on Hi. his side of the table, though? It's weird because there wasn't any of that anywhere.
it's a bit of a contradiction just that we don't have it anywhere because they even stated like this is exactly how we found the crime scene right yeah there ain't no unless that bottle is also sparkling water i'm gonna say it's important here Probably don't need this, I just don't know how mean this game is. But I feel like I'm gonna press here again first, actually. There's only one glass on the table. That's what really bugs me now. Cause like the question Yep, there it is. See the thing is I couldn't read whether or not there was carbonation in it, but I felt like it should have been two different beverages because why would she be eating what, you know, drinking wine and him carbonated, but then, yeah, there's supposed to be two glasses. <laughs> oh, you didn't have beef. That must have sucked. You didn't have sashimi, motherfucker. <laughs> This expression is very powerful and pure. God, the expression work in this game, I don't know what you, I mean, it's animation, right? Like that's just a, a, a part of animation, but whatever the specific part of animation is that just focuses on like facial expressions, if there is like a separate term for that, that is very good. They're doing a very good job of that. It would be hard to make a toast with one glass, don't you think? Hi. Damn it, that's so good. Man, they really animated that one good. That slap, dude. That slap.
Also, this fucking ye old persona character. Aggressively not doing crime. That's a really good lowercase r, though. <laughs> You can't just say sorry. <laughs> you can't just say sorry. I think we have rightly proven it is. Problem is the handbag, right? Because you could also put a gun in the handbag. Like, you claim she couldn't smuggle anything out in her hat or dress, but if we're admitting she smuggled one thing out in a handbag, why not two? Can we check that handbag? That bag, that bag, what you got in that bag? In the words of Luda. He was told to smuggle her out of there. That was that was literally his whole order. <coughs> I mean, yeah.
No need to do so. On this first of all we can see the wine glass on the inside of the bag presumably doesn't mean there's not another hidden compartment inside of it we also is it the victim's wrist and if so what's going on there looks like he's got like a chunk taken out of his wrist Let me look at this photograph. Hey, hand me, hand me that. Let me look at it. I'm gonna wave it at you a little bit. Come on, dude. No, it's fine. Let me, let me do it. 
Ooh, that's a new pose. We haven't seen that, uh, that, like, hand guard before. Judge threatening gavel. I mean, it's got to be this, right? can think of I'm not seeing anything else Hi. That way his meal was handed to him on one of those, like, cooling things. Or if your plate is too hot and their tables are dog shit, so you need a thing to put it on top of. And if he was under the effect of anesthesia, he may have been able to burn his wrist, especially if it was laughing gas, if he just, like, accidentally put his arm on it without realizing it. But it wasn't as his side of the table because she ordered it. like a cow upside down though. Oh fuck, it's right there. Okay, so that's why it's a cow, because he had a hot iron plate, put it to him, there was a cattle mark on the side of this hot plate, so I'm presuming this is a hot metal plate, which, I don't get it, but sure. Hot metal plate, he's under the effects of anesthesia, so he can't feel it, it's a, ser it's a steak, you know, so it's being served incredibly hot, otherwise why would there be a wooden board underneath it? But now, yeah, that would have been his right wrist, I think. If that would have been his right wrist, then we're extremely in the clear here. <laughs> I 
God. Chat, I won't lie to you. I seem really smart sometimes when I'm doing these, but I want you to know how dumb I am. I literally just dropped my right arm behind me in my chair to make sure it was still oriented the same way. To make sure that that yes was in fact a right hand. Because doing it without just a visual reference of my own damn hand was too hard. <laughs> is this means the plate was on his side of the table, but why? Oh, do we just need to prove a connection? That's easy. I already found that shape. I was wondering when the anesthesia was going to come into play. It is this one that I need. Because the other one has it obscured. That's clever. That also explains why this one has that part obscured and this one doesn't. Okay, yeah, this is the correct one. Okay, so it's a metal plate. Yeah, I've seen those hot plates serve things occasionally. Damn, man, that was pretty good. <laughs> Damn, Narahodo, you sure you haven't done this before, man? You're doing all right. <laughs> You're doing all right for someone who didn't know he was going to be doing defense attorney work until 
He was in the courtroom already. You're doing all right, kid. So there's only two choices here. Either he was still under the anesthesia and didn't feel it, or he was already dead. Those are the two choices that can happen. And if he was already dead, then that would mean someone decided to move him. I mean, he wasn't completely oblivious or dozing off, because, yeah, even if you were under anesthetic, you know, you'd still be aware of it, especially if it was like, you're not supposed to eat for three hours, but not... Like, you can... He walked there, you know? Like, he wasn't to the point where he wouldn't have felt something in his wrists. Also, he would have smelled the burning and probably heard his fucking skin sizzle. So... He had to be dead already. What? I mean, it's... It's right, he does have to be dead already. Which begs even more questions. Oh well. I'll cross that bridge when I find it.
Uh, yes, of course. Oh, okay. I mean, it makes sense she was a student, right? That's some good xenophobia right there. You know, English. God's language. <laughs> Shred this fool now that we've got her speaking openly. I am, however, very excited to see her blow up. That's going to be pretty good. but it might be fucking wrong. Lady. <laughs> well, it is time to press like that's all we know how to do. apologize if saying a bunch of shitty things about how I'm better than you made you upset. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm so great that just being around you makes you feel worse. <laughs> sorry I'm so famous. <laughs> and other favorite not apologies <laughs> of the 21st century. Amen. <laughs> you might not have noticed it, but this stupid idiot <laughs> is actually pretty great. Yeah, yeah. Threaten away. So did smuggle a glass out, but let's keep going. Now, what kind of evidence do you think they should be producing? I'm just wondering what you mean by that statement specifically.
<laughs> I'm glad the detective is like, oh man. I really like how you had 20 minutes to solve that I did the crime, and if you didn't do it successfully, I got off scot-free. Really like that way your system works. Go for it. Hi. All right, show me what your move is, bro. <laughs> show me your move, dog. There it is. It's true, sometimes someone will say something really dumb and then just have no reaction to it and think it's fine and then you see everyone else in the room kind of shoot them a look like, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> okay, lady testifying is our focus. Okay, so we can switch who we're questioning. Sounds pretty good.
What's the info? Press the wrong button for a second. Okay. Should we test for poison? There's one way. Hi. Water. Water. Tastes like fuck all. That's pretty good. Just shut up. <laughs> Hush.
So, all that proves is that there is no poison specifically in the bottle, right? Because there's other vectors of poison. So what could the other vector of poisoning be? If we were assuming it was poisoning through a drink, you wouldn't have to put it in the bottle, especially because if you were doing a toast, then that would mean you'd both be drinking from it. So you wouldn't want to put it in the bottle. You would have to put it in the glass. And if you were perhaps hiding murder weapons, you wouldn't be so much concerned with a gun. You'd be more concerned with the real murder weapon, which since the bottle didn't have the poison and the glass in fact had the poison, you might, for example, want to sneak away from the crime scene with, I don't know, could be anything. Good blowback. The glass, the glass, come on guys, the glass. <laughs> come on guys, you're breaking my balls here, the glass. Yeah, you're Professor's helper. Not Professor Helper though, that's very different. A legal assistant. All right. Ah, so it's the professor's daughter. Well, folks, I'm really liking this one so far. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to uh, go, uh, I'm, this is going to be it for the stream. I'm going to go host y'all over. Uh, excited to have more folks, uh, or, you know, more, more of these cases down the line. I'm going to host y'all over to somebody. But uh, I am going to contact my good friend, probably Admiral, if Admiral's not passed out, and just figure out where the save files are stored for this and make sure it did actually save so that I don't have to speedrun three hours of visual novels. But, uh, hey, if you aren't already following, hey, come on, hey, come on, don't be mean. Hey, hey, come on, don't be mean. Don't be, don't be a real dink. Uh, yeah. Drop me a follow, it's free, helps me out, and I'm gonna 
host you over to let me go ahead and go through who is live oh you know who i haven't hosted in a hot minute who's just an incredibly wonderful person someone who uh whenever i have questions about things a lot of times i'll, I'll think about their opinion on it i'm gonna host you over to half coordinated who is one of the most respectful and dope people on the planet just cool as hell you should also follow half coordinated if you don't what the hell so i'm gonna host y'all over I'll catch you uh, tomorrow for some assorted gaming, and uh, I'll catch you Tuesday for more great Ace Attorney. Thanks. Have a good one. Take easy.